Hey guys, it's Jen from iCreate Crafts. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to create these amazing little bath salt items. I just used dollar store items for this and I'm so excited to show you what they look like. I have so many here, I couldn't stop. My kids came out and started helping me, so I'm gonna show you how to make these using dollar store items. So I'm using these little plastic to-go cups. I bought these, oh my gosh, a few years ago off of Amazon for this intention to make these, but I just never did. And then I bought dollar store bath bombs and bath fizzies here. They are so cute. Thank you, Katie. Um, you can't smell it, but this smells amazing. And then these guys are actually like jelly kind of they turn into. So it says if you use two or more, they turn your bath water into like jelly. So I thought they'd be really cute for the kids. And then I just got loofahs here too. So I have this really big one that came individual by itself. And then I have this littler one. I can show you really quick, this littler one that we put in here. This came with a pack of four for a dollar. So I mean, this is gonna go a long way. So I just put the little bath bombs in there and a little bit of tissue on the bottom. And then I just put it in here and I just pulled the top part out. But I mean, oh my gosh, guys, if you could smell this, it smells absolutely amazing here. Okay, I'm done with that one for now. But look, like the Katie made this one. She used the Epsom salt here and she put a little bit of food coloring in it. And then we just layered it. And then there's a little frog in here. So this would be good for a kid. And I'm using Epsom salt just like this. And you can put the food coloring in it and put it in, you know, put it in your water. What do you got, Katie? She, oh, she likes it's that one. It's my favorite one. There's a little green thing. Cause we, some of them we use like little paper things in. Yeah. And there's just one there, but that's my favorite. Cause a little turtle. She likes that The one. lighting's kind of bad though. But I like this too. It's just the loofah in there and then these. I really wish you guys could smell this cause this smells absolutely amazing. And I'm gonna finish this off. I'm gonna put like a little tag on it or something and say like mom time or kid time, bath time, whatever. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys a really quick video tutorial on how to do this. And then these are just the bath toys. So depending on how you price this I think I'm gonna start mine at six dollars for these um, these come out to like 33 cents a piece and then like I said you get four of these uh, loofahs so that's 25 cents a piece for those but it's so simple to do so you just take your cup and then you pour in some Epsom salt and you can use food coloring you don't have to use food coloring okay so I'm just gonna use a little bit of red and just put a few dots in here and then just stir it up and this make this makes like a Himalayan salt looking thing because it's hard to make pink. It was hard to make purple. Yeah, we couldn't make purple. It always turned black every time. Yeah. But I mean, this is perfect. This is so good for your skin. And you know, I would love to get this as a present. So obviously you've got to stir it up more than this, but I'm just showing you guys really quick. And then you can make layers if you want. It kind of has layers on it. I don't know if you can see the white there. Um, but then you throw in your bath bombs, however you want, and then this guy, and then you put him on top, which this one's too full. I need a smaller one for on top, but you guys get the point. Yeah, thank you, Katie. So then you just put this on here. It's easier to put the little guy through. Perfect. So just like that. So you got the Epsom salt at the bottom and then you have the bath bombs that you throw in and then they fizz up. So I just want to show you a really quick tutorial on these. I absolutely love how these turn out. You know, it cost me, I think I figured out $1.80 per one, including the cups. So yeah, so however you want to sell it, but I absolutely love this. So again, here's this one with the layers in it and then you got the loofah. And then Katie and made this yeah, one. When we tried to make purple, it turned out to be like a brown. So I was like, why not make it like a dirt? And you can't really see, but there's a frog in there. Not a real frog, obviously. <laughs> and then the loofah. I'm not yeah. sure if that's what they're called. It but. is. I love this. So we just wanted to show you a really quick tutorial on how to create these. They are so much fun. The ones without the loofah at the top, I figure I'm gonna put it in a cellophane bag and then I'm gonna put a um, you know a tie at the top. But again, I'm gonna put something on here where it would say like, like I said, like mom's bath or mom's time or you know something like that, bath time for the kids. But this is such a quick and inexpensive, easy project to do. Like I said, I was really surprised all four of my kids came and, and had fun with me. So. Everything came from the dollar store. 
except for the cups and then the Epsom salt. I just picked the Epsom salt up at um, Walmart and then the cups came off of Amazon. So I will leave the link to everything in the description below. Uh, you can get, you know, the food coloring. Everybody has food coloring. It only takes a few uh, dots in there. So I will leave everything in the description below, but I really hope you like this tutorial. Stay tuned to the end and I'm going to show you each one of these what they look like. Here they are all finished. My girls and I had so much fun creating these together. They were so easy and fun to create and costed us under $2 each to make. We added some straws, some red pom-poms to make the top look like cherries, and a label for each cup. We finished them up by adding some Dollar Tree cellophane bags to make them look more personalized. We hope you enjoyed this quick how-to tutorial. We had a lot of fun creating these wonderfully relaxing DIY bath salts. And we hope you create your own bath time cups. Happy crafting, everyone!